With the iPhone 7, Apple finally introduced waterproofing. It's rated IP67, but what does that actually mean? Apple has been long overdue for waterproofing. We've seen them in older devices like the Moto G and the newer ones like the Samsung Galaxy S7. And Apple even experimented a little bit with some rubber gaskets on the iPhone 6S, but they've never gone full waterproof like these devices here. But they've finally done it with the iPhone 7 in order to take advantage of your waterproofing to the best, you need to know what that actually means. So let's go ahead and check that out. So in order to find this out, we need to take a look at an ingress protection chart. That is the IP rating on all of waterproof devices. There are two numbers that go along with the ingress protection rating. The first number is going to talk about solid protection, meaning how well it traps dust from getting into the device. And the second number talks about water. So on the iPhone 7, there is a 6 for the solids, and that is the highest you can possibly get for your ingress protection. That means it's going to completely block any dust, and there's no chance it's going to get in to the phone. Scale goes from 0 to 6, and for dust, 6 is the highest it goes. And then the second number, which on the iPhone 7 is a 7, on the Galaxy S7, that is an 8. That second number is for waterproofing. And again, that goes from zero, but it goes up to nine. So nine is the highest rating you could possibly get. And on the iPhone 7, it's a seven. So that seven means that it can be in water up to one meter for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, the pressure from the water might compromise the seal and water could seep in a little bit. But up to 30 minutes in one meter of water is the rating for the iPhone 7. But there you have it. The iPhone 7 is rated IP67. There's no chance dust can get in and it can be up to one meter of water for 30 minutes and you'll still be safe. This isn't completely waterproof. It's not 69, so you can't take it deep sea diving, but you can take it for a swim as long as you don't go over a meter for over 30 minutes. You can get it wet in the rain. You can take it in the shower. It's gonna be perfectly fine, but that's gonna do me for this video. If you guys are interested in the iPhone 7, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Our phone is going to be coming this Friday. We also got the new Apple Watch. So all of that content is going to be happening right here on the channel. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to hit that like button. Thank you guys so much for watching as always. This is Mark with Apple Tech 128 and have a great day.